interesting drawing. All right, am I alive? Can I tell her now? Like, I went back in time, I saved your dad, but then he actually... You were handicapped, and it was awful. Chloe, you're alive, yes. Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss, and now you're all over me? I'm just... I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Tell her what happened. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Yep, I was. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. Why don't you tell her? That'd be the first thing I'd do. I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. Like, I can understand her being angry that I killed her dad, but at the same time, I saved her life. Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Alright. What do we got? We know this, like, club is pretty so close, messed up. So far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. Okie dokie. I thought he got kicked out of the house. Why would he still be I here? I can't abuse this level of my... I'm so sorry, William. It's not fair you had to die twice. Yeah, well... This for the greater good, I guess. This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. How much time have I altered since? A lot. Uh, they look the snow dough. That snow dough always makes me think of William and Chloe. Right, let's get out of here. Let's go down to the basement. Let's see what we gotta do. I was like, since maybe David I could go in there. Be in there. I better mosey along for a change. I thought, uh, I thought you got, I could have sworn she said go to a hotel. Like, last part. Right there. You might want to keep walking. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Dark what? The dark room? Brr, brr, brr. Poor guy. He's a good guy at heart, but he's a nutcase. Uh, Alright, let's get into the garage, shall we? I don't know what I'd find. I'm pretty sure he would have taken all this stuff if he's leaving. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. I see a locker. What does Warren want? Oh, yo, Max. Your friend Chloe texted me that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds hot. <laughs> Clay, I should text you. I sure didn't have her number. Now uh, I get why you didn't want to go ape with me. Go with Chloe. She looks cool enough for you. I have a lot of cool friends like you. Yep, friends. That's a word. 
Uh, okay, weirdo. Got a lot of messages. Who's Richard Marsh? I don't even remember who that is. Uh, where's his name? How's this from? Grace and bravery. Roof with her, you must know. Okay, so her funeral. Dad. <laughs> uh. Hello? Half of these are pointless, like I swear, like nothing, like there's no point in reading any of these. Email, we done that. I want to go over here where the car was. Can check out this locker. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Uh, let's try three, eight, one, five. Shit. <laughs> for once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, and I need to find a way to break this padlock. Oh. Oh. Look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move this plank if I want to take... Excuse me. Just one picture, please. Why are there baby blue jay eggs inside the garage? The real question. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Probably put the the plank back, you know, that was there for a reason. You know. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight. Hey, anyway. achievement. Time lapsed. What did that do? Take optional photo, yeah, yeah, I did. I did do that. Okay, so I don't know what the password is, so I gotta break the padlock, which is relatively easy. I have a hammer, that is. Uh that's going to make a mess. Okay. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Or I could look at this email and see if there's a code on it. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. Uh, if no. there is one. Oh, wait, there's more emails. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. At least he had... Wish I had surveillance footage okay. of that conversation. Here. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts, too. Of course he is. What's this? There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Uh, I feel like there's probably something in here. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. But I don't have time. I wish Chloe could too. Yeah, let's steal some guns while we're Either at it. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. He's allowed to be up the arm. It's America, girl. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? I feel like I saw the number like I in the last David part. I wonder David is going to the party. But I can't remember, so forget it. Let's just break into this bitch. <sighs> Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. This is fucking weird. <laughs> he, a security guard who watched the kid get beat up. You know, doing your job real, real well there, bud. Score. Back to Chloe now. Well, you know. You could use your powers, but whatever. It's cool. I guess not. You don't want to use your powers. Don't use them. Oh, I can't use them because uh, I use them too much. What should be on the note? Ouch. David, do not be here when I get back from work. I mean it. Yeesh. Poor guy. Not really. Anyways. Back to Chloe. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. 
David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Max, now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. Sure, as we do something extremely illegal by going into his room and stealing things. Hipster teacher, douchebag, president of the school, principal, or whatever the hell he is. I wonder what kind of funny thing's gonna happen to that purple hair chick today. I wonder if she's gonna get hit by a car or something. <laughs> it's like every time I come back to school, something messed up happens to her. Nothing important, though. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too Those much lame. going on cold. in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Well, she wants it. Hot for teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. Ugh, shut up. She Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Chloe likes the old guys. All right, so a lot of things to Let's get see done. see if I can find out where Nathan is. Probably hanging out with some losers. He was a skater boy. She said, see you later, boy. Just ran right through him. It's been so long since I've seen you. Hey, you too. Have fun talking. Cool for us now, Chloe. Uh, can look at Zachary. Why would I want to look at Zachary? Hey, it's the drone girl. Hey, Brooke. How are you? Considering what happened to Kate, I could be better. Are you okay? Where's Nathan? I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? I was distracted by Warren asking me out to the drive-in. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. I did see him this morning heading off campus. He looked more angry than usual. I wouldn't look for him now if I were you. Yo, give me your drone. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant caved and let me fly her again. So take a spin. Now I can look for him. I have to see what time I'm going to the drive-in with Warren on Saturday. Oh, look at you. She, we already been over this. That sounds fun. It would be good for you and Warren to take a road trip after this week. Warren got a new car. Or an old new car. So I'm all about a serious road trip out of here after this week. Her her voice doesn't match her face. <laughs> she sounds like she's from like Wisconsin. Okay, well, I'm not flying this at all. It's moving by itself, so that's fine. Let's see if uh, we could spot what's his face with this at all, though. Doesn't look like it, though. I don't understand why I can't fly it myself. That'd make it so much more fun. Uh, it looks like it's just going to go around here, so fuck that. Quit. Thanks. Anything else? 
Good. Oh, Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Or I could talk to everybody else. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. <laughs> okay, I'm talking to How Samuel. Are you doing, this is Max? fucking weird. Been a tough <sighs> week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. Uh, actually, you know what? I don't want to talk to you. I'm sorry. You're weird. I better get going now. <laughs> I don't want to talk to anybody, honestly, because all they're going to tell me is a bunch of crap, and I don't have, to have time for that. All right, let's go, Chloe. Let's go, Chloe. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you, so you were going to school here. You couldn't be back in the but dorm for all you know. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. <sighs> Only an hour. I've been shooting for longer than that. It's so lame. They don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. <laughs> Batmax. Shouldn't be too hard. The word is close success. Love even. Even, not Evan. Uh, skateboarding is not a crime. Of paper, uh, dirty ass bathroom, and I has art. You can has art. Bigfoot's got big balls. Okay. Uh, the Prescott's rule this town. Well, I wonder whose place that is. Eh? It's all good in the woods. Someone's a pothead. No unique picture of reality. Even Hawking. Uh, sorry, Kate. Okay, some random guy. Uh, this obviously this guy. This can only be Nathan's room. Go on in. Why isn't it locked? Okay, it is locked. I thought for sure we could just walk on in. I bet you knock first to see if there's anyone in there. That would have been the best suggestion. At least I think. What in the F are those? Hector? What a weird artsy fartsy dude. Now I need to find Nathan's phone. Or anything with clues. Lamp. His lamp obviously has clues, right? Because he loves that lamp. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. He loved lamp. <laughs> Let's grab his uh, camera. That's probably it. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <sighs> bastard. Is he a bastard? Because his parents have money? I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again. Uh, that's a Prescott's... gun manual. That's great. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A yes. gift from. All right, let's use the computer. Nathan is way into this party. Gorge, let me know when you're That's wearing the Mortex this week so I can do something. Okay, so. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Oh, man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Shuffle me for you and your mother and I are to talk. If need be, make an appointment anytime your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour. Now let's stick to prescriptions. You come quiet while well, Penn State is being developed. I know being a Prescott is a burden, and I'll guide you into this room step by step, as did my father. It's hard for me when my dad opened my eyes toward Esney, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. Now I'm going to blah, 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 blah. Don't fuck it up, son! Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. <laughs> Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Okay. Uh, do do. A lot of DVDs, man. These films all have a dark pattern. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. Yeah, he's a weirdo, man. 
Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What is with this dude? Weird guy, man. Oh, man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. That's even creepier. <laughs> Honestly. And why wouldn't he have his phone with him? That'd be, like, the real question here, right? I know. I'm going to open this drawer. That is so Chloe. Yeah, ask me to talk or I'm going to tell everybody what you did. I'm going to pay you, motherfucker. Oh, my God. Chloe. <laughs> Take that picture. Prove it to people. Uh, where would your things be? That's just a lens. Damn, in the floor. Right what the hell are all those marks on the floor? Looks like blood marks. Move the couch. Let's find out what you're hiding. A dead body. Oh shit, it has got a secret stash behind his couch. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Yeah? Is it yours? Oh, now I have Nathan's phone, so I can- I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. Well, it doesn't help when he's taking it with what looks like champagne. I'm not supposed to take prescription drugs with alcohol. I was expecting him to be at the door. Hey, <laughs> what are you doing? Treat me the fuck out. GTFO before he shows up, please. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? His room was clean. His and burner phone. Creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. There he is. That's my phone. What are you doing in my dorm? Not your dorm. It's a man's dorm. You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <laughs> the way this guy talks kills me. Max, I got this. Yo, we're get you're the gonna get your ass face. kicked again, man. Oh, he had put it up. Yes. <gasps> Fuck yeah, man. You are so fucking dead. Yeah. Pull out a gun on you? Really? Get off me, bro. <laughs> Kick his ass, bro. <laughs> Um. Yeah, we'll stop him. I don't want him to get kicked out of school. Warren, stop it! Come on. Oh, oh my head. Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you, you're all dead. Why wouldn't she just take the gun from him? Let's go now. Be like, yo, this guy just threatened me with a my gun. My dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Not gonna be like, hey, my my handle's completely broken. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. No, we shouldn't try to be better than that. Fuck that shit. 